as we know the human body has lots of levers basically every single joint we have some kind of lever whether it's first class second class or third class now how do we solve determine the load exerted by the muscle or the load on the bone things like that how do we solve all of these now the lever problems because we don't know the direction of the force on the fulcrum and also this force is also unknown then if we take the moments with respect to the um, the lever on, with respect to the fulcrum or um, So we don't know the direction of force right here at this fulcrum point. So if we take moment with respect to this point, summation of all moments with respect to fulcrum, or pivot point, some people call it pivot fulcrum, they're same thing. Then you do summation of all moments uh, with respect to the fulcrum you can typically assume into a clockwise or counterclockwise positive moment if you sum all of these zero then you can solve the unknown so for example you're trying to lift um, let's say your body weight which is um, 300 pounds and then this is your leg muscle applied force now how much do you need for the calf muscle to be applied to lift that 300 pound force so you could calculate whatever necessary so to summarize any pivot problem any lever system um, problems you just take moments with respect to the fulcrum and sum of all moment to zero and then you can solve the unknown force